Hello, my name is Thomas. Today, high schools across the nation are experiencing problems with bullying. Statistics from National Center of for Education Statistics, the Institute of Education Sciences, and StopBullying.gov help to strengthen evidence of bullying by reporting that 20% of students in grades 6 through 12 experience bullying, 64% of bullied students do not report it, and 70.6% of young people say they have seen bullying in their schools. In an effort to show our real side of this issue, we will be interviewing high school students about their school experiences with bullying. One of the students is Sam. So Sam, tell me, what was your life like in high school? Well, my life in high school um, was very mixed. I mean, I have some good memories and some bad, just like we all do. But um, I can remember um, not fitting in, feeling, um, it's hard to put into words, but um, I have very mixed memories of high school. Were you, were you ever bullied by someone in high school? I mean, by one person I was, who was very stubborn and know it all not mentioning any names, um, who always um, like excludedly me and sort of made me feel bad, sort of made me feel bad that I had autism and repetitive thoughts and but um, there were other people who sort of ganged up on me. They were, it's hard. I don't like thinking about it. I only like be living in the present. And uh, how did you deal with it? I just tried to ignore. I tried, I mean, I did get a teacher involved, but I tried to find other friends from other classes. So Sam, uh, do you have any advice for other people that have been bullied? Well, um, do not fight back. That's my ultimate advice, but tell a teacher, try to, um, remove yourself from that person and maybe find other friends. So uh, has anybody reached out to you? Well actually this one bully apologized to me on Facebook two or three years ago and he said he'd changed, he'd grown up. And people change. N n once a bully always a bully is not true. People can change. Yeah, I definitely agree with that. And yeah, and that's, people should always definitely apologize, you know, when they hurt, when they hurt, hurt your feelings. We wish um, we could fight back or we could stand up to these bullies, but we don't always think about the consequences. Well, um, it was very nice talking to you, and hopefully people will, will find help they need and they won't feel alone. Oh, cool. Very nice, nice, very nice uh, talking to you today. And, and um, that's the end of our show, and we'll see you next time.